Zara's wearing a perfume I don't like, even though I've told her I don't like it. Good morning to Husky number one. And good morning to Husky number two. Happy Saturday. I'm gonna take you through a week in my life. Cause we've got a big week. We've got Hosea, Memorial Day weekend, 16 weeks out today. And then I go to Australia on Friday. So yeah, thought it'd be fun to do a little bit of a weekly vlog situation. Okay, so like I said, oh, there we go. It is Memorial Day weekend. I, oh, by the way, just got my nails done. Don't know if I love the shape, but I love the color. My other nails were so overgrown, but I'm just about to go to, oh, I've got the hiccups. <laughs> just about to go to the gym, hit a leg day, may film snippets of it. Not going to do a whole run through. Kind of just want to get in and get out because we have a cookout or a barbecue. Uh, at my parents' house. So, yeah, that's our plan. But, yeah, going to get legs done. Last session of the week. Come home, shower, make lunch to, <laughs> to take with me. Um, then tomorrow we may have plans. We may not. We don't really know. And then this week is so hectic. But <laughs> I'm going to try and film as much as I can because it is a bit of a fun week as well. And I go to Australia in less than a week and I'm so, so excited. All right, I'm going to go. something the 26th and I did not really film anything yesterday simply because I forgot but I went to my parents house for a cookout played some ping pong came home chilled then went to Josh's parents house to watch the basketball game and play ping pong and this morning Josh and I are just having a really big reset day I'm just taking my check-in which you would have just seen um this week Weight like my weight's been dropping every week, but this week was the first week where it actually dropped, which is honestly to be expected because you know your weight will drop, 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 and then it'll come to a halt. So I haven't, I'm in week four of my comp prep now, and I haven't had to change cardio, calories, any of that, which is fantastic for me. So yeah, I'm assuming this week we're probably gonna make some changes though. So I'm gonna send my check-in to Dan. I'm also gonna fake tan because I do have a concert on Tuesday and I wanna feel good for it. Not that you need a fake tan to feel good, but it makes me feel good, so. And Josh and I are having like a big clean reset day and he's just back from taking the dogs out, so. Hey, hi boys. He's gonna have his post-walk zoomies. Good morning, it's Tuesday at like 5.30. And I didn't vlog anything yesterday. This week's a very busy week, but today I look so tired. My eyes are still swollen, but today I'll take you around for a little bit of my day. I mean, during the day, nothing exciting, but we have Hosea tonight, which I'm so excited. We saw him perform last year in Boston, and now he's coming to Indianapolis, and I'm so excited. Um, so yeah. Gonna go see Hosea, and then today I have work, gym, and the dentist appointment. Oh, and I have a posing session with Toby as well, so busy day. That's why I'm waking up at five, and I'm so tired, but hopefully I'm tiring myself out so much that I sleep like an angel on my flight to Australia. 
that's the girl. Happy Tuesday. Oh, conference update as well. I did my check-in and I got a calorie drop and cardio increase. So yeah, I'm eating like 16 something calories now and cardio is at three. Like I gotta do two sessions of 350 cows on the stepper. But my weight's dropped this morning back. Um, I've only, two weeks ago I hit 57.9 or 57.8 and this morning I hit 57.9. So my goal for the month was to get in the 57s and we're in the last week of May and I think this week's gonna be the week I'm in like the high 57s which is so good. Posing, I've done my check-ins for the day which feels really good because it's super early but now I'm just making a snack to have post dentist appointment. So I'm going to the dentist and then close to the dentist is actually my gym. So I'm just gonna get my gym session done. So we're having five of these guys and then some butter, Vegemite, and some with almond butter. I ordered corn thins off um, Amazon because you can't get corn thins in America and it makes me sad. And a gal, like for five of these equals like two rice cakes. So I was like, gal needs her volume because she's always hungry and I'm starving right now. I'm gonna, normally I have a banana on the rice uh, corn thins, but I'm gonna have the banana now. I'm filming on my phone because my camera, my skin is really doing the most right now. But I'm filming with my phone because I needed to charge my camera. Now I'm just gonna eat my pre-workout meal, which is just rice cakes as I showed you, or corn thins. I'm gonna treat myself to an energy drink because I deserve it after the dentist and train some of body and cardio and practice posing. Of choice today, I feel like in all my vlogs I'm in the same area because I'm being physio, or my dentist is in this area, go to the same gas station, but C4 is my fuel of choice and Vegemite rice cakes. Okay, I think this is the outfit we're choosing for Hosier. I'm gonna have a black belt, though I don't know if I wanna go, a, I have a strapless white shirt that I think I'm vibing more than this. I don't know, I'm really struggling with an outfit right now. I've wanted to wear a black leather skirt and it was just not working for me. So I'm gonna go do my makeup though. It's been a while since I've got myself looking pretty and cute. Ah, I don't know about this top now. I'm just like, eh, I don't know. Okay, I think I'm vibing this a lot more. Obviously gonna have a belt on and I'm surprised it still fits honestly because I got this pre-boob job. <laughs> But we squeeze into it anyway. I don't know if it's like too small or too bra looking, but this will be held up a little bit more as well. And I'll be wearing docks. I think this is the vibe I want to go for. This is the hair and makeup look. I look like a different person because I haven't done myself up in so long. I feel so cute. Oh gosh. And then I'm going this outfit and I'm going to go some docks. I don't look like myself. It's crazy. Well, I do, but I just haven't seen myself done up in so long. I'm also getting my hair done tomorrow, so I'm so excited to get the... Because you can see the regrowth is coming through, so getting the red freshened up, which red is my color. For those who don't know, my I've gone all colors. I've been blonde, I've been black, I've been brown. Now I'm doing the red, and the red I'm going to keep at least for this year, and then who knows? We might, might do something different next year, we'll see. I generally find I can keep a hair color for a year, and then I get bored of it, so... The brunette I had for maybe just over a year, like a year and three months, Blonde probably stretched out a little bit longer because I it's a, it was a process because my hair was black and then I moved it to blonde. 
<sighs> she just changes her mind. But what do we think of the red? Comment below. Anyways, I'm gonna go take the boys out and make a snack to take with me on the road. I look horrendous. I'm so tired, but it is now Wednesday. The concert was good. I mean, it was good. And then they paused the concert for the weather. There was like a storm, which like didn't even really hit us. However, after that, it just kind of got miserable. I was hungry. Josh was hungry. We were tired. Our backs were hurting because we we're in the pit, so we didn't have a seat. Then people were just like, I mean, it's to be expected when you're in the pit, right? People are just all up in your personal space. <laughs> and Josh and I just couldn't handle it. So we left before the encore. And we're like, you know what? Like, we saw Hosea in, it's now May. We saw Hosea in October last year. We're like, we're okay if we miss, you know, like work song and we'll hear it on the way out. Um, so yeah, it's Wednesday now. I've had a shit ton of work. I was going to train today so I don't have to train on Sunday when I land in Australia. But, like, we got home. We got to sleep at, like, midnight. And waking, like, for me to get to the gym, I would have had to wake up at 5. And I'm just so exhausted. So I took an extra hour and a half sleep. I'm about to make a coffee, get into work. And then I am just going to take a rest day today and train. Because, honestly, I feel like I'm going to get a better sleep on the plane <laughs> than what I did last night. So that means rest day calories though, which kind of sucks. I haven't eaten this low since comp prep. Like even when I reversed, I didn't eat this low. So it's not even that low. It's 1580 calories. So it's fine. It's basically 1600. But just seeing a 15 is like, oh, it's low. Anyways, I'm going to make a coffee and get to work. Today is a big client day. I've also got physio and I've got a hair appointment to freshen up my red. I'm so excited. Okay, so I've just gotten to my hair salon. I don't know if you can see that, but I'm gonna get my hair freshened up. I'm so excited. Color has been freshened up. I feel like with the black shirt, you can't really see, but I mean, she's red again. Now it's time to go home and work all afternoon. I'm so tired. <gasps> but I can okay, so you can probably see the color a little bit better. It looks really dark. I swear it's red. Anyways, like I said earlier, I'm gonna go do some work. I'm so behind on work today. I'm so tired from the concert last night, but I'm gonna eat, make a coffee, get to work. Tomorrow I've got nothing exciting except for I'm gonna pack. So I'm gonna do a little bit of a pack with me situation. And then I'm going to Australia on Friday. I'm so freaking excited i'm gonna start a whole new vlog of like my week i'm going to melbourne for one week gold coast for a week and a half and then brisbane for my last few days so i'm so excited to go home um it's been six months like last time i went to australia was a layover to go to bali so like mom came and saw me at the airport but it was nothing but i'm actually just going and i'm so excited and yeah it's gonna be a long journey but i tried to line it up so it doesn't really affect comp prep too much so like my flight to la leaves at 4 p.m so i'll be able to get my training in most of my meals i'll probably have like dinner in la probably pack some food and then my flight from la leaves at like basically midnight and then i land in australia at like 7 a.m so i get like a full it's like 14 hours but it's like overnight so i'm gonna try and sleep i am eating one quarter of my calories on that flight which is like 
400 and something I'm allowed on the plane, which isn't bad if I try and sleep most of the way. Then I land in Australia at like 7 a.m. Sunday. Also, look at what a stunning day it is in Indiana. I don't know why my camera doesn't focus. Um, I'm just doing my steps now. I was packing, but then I got over packing, so now I'm doing steps and I feel really lean right now. I feel like this week my body's just been like, yeah, here are your abs back. I feel like you can also see it in my face. We still have 15 weeks to go, so... <laughs> uh, anyways, I'm so tired. Today's been huge. I'm gonna finish up, I have about 6,000 steps to do, so not ideal. And it's getting towards 8.30. No, it's getting closer to nine. And I've still got to pack. I am utterly exhausted, but I still have to pack for my trip. Okay, honestly, I'm just gonna finish the rest tomorrow. I'm so tired and hungry. I'm not like comp prep hungry yet. I feel like if you've done comp prep, you know the difference between like hungry and like comp prep hungry. Like the part where you're like super food focused and like kind of want to die. I'm not at that stage yet, but I'm just like hungry, like generally, because I haven't eaten for like four hours. But I'm done. I'm so done with today. I'm tired. I'm gonna write it to the do list in my notes. Whenever I feel super overwhelmed or feel like I'm gonna forget stuff, like I have like a calendar system thing I use and I have like a schedule and all that, but sometimes I feel like I just need to write it on my notes app and just like have a detailed list of all the shit I gotta get done. So it's an early wake up tomorrow, 5 a.m. Good morning, quick update. It is Friday the 31st of May. I'm going to Australia today, which I'm so excited, but we have a busy, busy morning prior. I don't know how much I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and film, but I don't know how much I'll get. Um, I basically, I was up at five, it's now 5.40. Gonna go to the gym, train up, do cardio, come home. I gotta eat, then I gotta pack the rest of my stuff cause I just got a bit too lazy last night. Oh, I need a shower as well. Um, I don't know why my camera's flashing at me. Anyways, got to eat, finish packing, um, do a little bit of work. Got to leave at 12.30ish to then drop my house keys off to my boyfriend's mum. Then I got to go to the physio because I have their SI belt. Do Drop that off, then I got to get to my dad's. Dad's going to take me to the airport. We're going to leave around 1.30. Then I got to fly... thought I heard thunder. Then I'm going to fly to LA at 4. And then... I land at like 5 LA time and then I got like 5 hours to kill until my flight at like 11. So I'm going to stop this vlog once I get to LA and then it'll be the start of my Melbourne vlog. But yeah, I don't know honestly what has gone into this vlog because it's been a weekly vlog. I'm just picking up my camera whenever. I feel like it's just more than me talking, which those videos are so boring. So I apologize that all I do is talk, but let's get to the gym. Okay, we're almost packed. Got that bag there. My suitcase there. I, the, literally the only thing I need to pack is my last meal. Um, and also my like laptop and stuff. Pretty much ready to go. This bag's so great, but like I really just try and pack a lot in there. And I honestly don't know how I get away with this much stuff on carry on, but we do. This outfit, I'm not loving it, but cause I like, it's a bodysuit, right? But I'm like, fuck doing it up. <laughs> but honestly, like just fuck that. But, and these pants are low-waisted technically, but, so like, I feel like it would look good if they were high-waisted. And also, they're getting too big on me. Anyways. So, 
something about being in an airport just makes me want to eat. But I've got one litre bottle of water I just bought and this looks good. Just a vitamin water, zero sugar. Has zero calories. And it says it will support my immune system, which I feel like is needed. My bag just fell. Okay, I'm gonna deal with that. Bye.